What's going on YouTube? It's your girl V the Notary. Hope you guys are having a great day today. Again, my apologies for the week absence. You know, I definitely am adamant on trying to at least post once, usually twice a week. But you know, I, that this daggone sickness, I was sick back to back, then my daughter got sick and we were traveling, but I think we're good. We got the sickness out of the house. And I think that we are going to be good. Hopefully no more, you know, um, sickness for the rest of the year. We've had enough being sick for the whole 2024. But anyway, um, I wanted to talk to you guys because, you know, one of my most recent videos that I did, you know, I came to you guys very heartfelt to get your opinions on um, calling out various signing services for, not only the treatment of, you know, notaries, but just the disparaging um, low pay in these low ball offers that we have been getting. And, you know, I wanted to see your guys, your opinions about it, because as you guys know, I'm a very, very, very big advocate for us being compensated appropriately, for us sticking together, for us utilizing different resources and working together so that you know, we can ensure to ensure that we're paid and compensated appropriately as, you know, loan signing agents. And I think that we have to work together to do this. But anyway, so I asked you all, you know, okay, how do y'all feel about us having, you know, a safe place to talk about various signing services who are not doing the right things? And the reason why I did that is because in the past, in my community tab, I have, you know, um, one specific signing service, I came to y'all and was like, okay, this is an example of a low ball offer. And there was a couple of people that were like, well, you shouldn't do that. We shouldn't, we shouldn't put them on blast. And it's not even about blasting. It's about holding them accountable. So I wanted to ask you how, you know, maybe fast forward a few months later to now, what do you guys feel about that? Um, and overwhelmingly, you all said, no, let's blast them. Um, or let's, in a, you know, let's put it in a nicer way wrap it in a nicer bowl, let's hold them accountable and hopefully this will incite some changes. And so that's what we're gonna do. And so I'm going to bring you guys uh, a signing service that I just wanna make you aware of that is not, they're not offering offers that are anywhere near what they should be offering and that is cloud signing services, okay? Um, I personally have never had a signing with cloud signing services. I They are on my list of my 101 signing services to sign up with. And um, I won't say what, you know, uh, signing platform, I, I, because I just won't say the signing pl platform that all of their offers come from. If you see, if you've gotten one from cloud, then you know, I don't even need to say that the actual platform that all of their offers come out on. But... Um, I'm, I'm calling them out and I want to make you guys aware. And again, this is not to blast them, but I do think it's important to hold them accountable because some of the offers that come out from them are just egregious. Um, for example, and I, I decided because I was debating, like, should I add as an attachment some of the actual offers? I'm not going to do that. We're just going to have a, you know... Um, we're going to have a community where we can just talk about it, okay? They'll, what they do in their strategy is they will send, for example, and I'm not making this up, this is a real offer that they have sent out. For example, a seller signing. They will send out a seller signing offer for $20, right? And so they'll send that out and you can tell that they're doing this to fish and see like, okay, well, which, which notary will bite, okay? And it's $20 for seller signing and it will require scan backs, which is just crazy. Um, and so normally when those $20 signings come out in my area, I'm going to assume that the notaries do not, they pay it dust. Like $20 is crazy. So then what they'll do is they'll send out five minutes later or 10 minutes later an offer for $30 then $35, then $40. But they always start out with 
a 15 to $20 offer for a seller signing. And this is what I'm saying to you guys. And every time they, that they do this, this is, this is how low it is. Um, for their buyer signings, they'll send out an offer for $35. And I, I don't have to spell it out for you guys. I've done this in so many of my videos where I, you know, I tell you what actually goes into these signings. And I don't need to, the writing is on the wall. You know what I'm saying? I don't need to, you know, break down in this particular video why that is egregious and why that is abysmal and why that is just totally not acceptable. And I think that it's not fair because what happens is when they send out those 20, 25, $30 signings, Some new notary or in some old or someone maybe let's just say in your area you haven't gotten signings in a while and you're just like, look, I'm just going to bite and I'm going to take this just because. What it happens it, is it, you know, uh, kicks off a trickle down effect and then, you know, it, in, in, it, it ends up affecting all of us, right? And there is under no circumstances, in my opinion... And I'm not talking about general notary work. I'm talking about for loan signings. Unless it's a loan signing for two pages or five pages, even that. I'm I'm personally not, it's not worth me leaving for no $20 loan signing. Like, and I got to scan back and then go, and I have to go to FedEx. It's just, I'm not doing that, you know? And I, I cannot tell you how to run your business, but I don't suggest you do it either. And I just think that it is unfair and it's very, it's very unethical for them to, to, with the, to send out any type of offer for $20. It's just not, it's not ethical. It's not right. And, you know, um, I want to see if you guys, if you guys have worked with cloud, cloud signings, I cannot speak to whether or not they are good with customer service. I can't speak to any of that because when I see their, um, offers, I, I literally just, um, decline just because of the fact of I just don't um I don't necessarily respect the company because I don't think that they respect us and all that goes into what we do so I'm I literally will not do any work with cloud signings um so again maybe some of you that have you know work with them can speak to their customer service and all of that and they could be very lovely right However, you, you know, you can't be nice and then unappreciative and unethical in your offers. And it, we just got to call it what it is. So I wanted to bring them to your attention. I would love to speak to someone that has worked with cloud signings just to give us some insight on how they actually do business. Because, you know, in addition to them being unethical with the way they're offering for their fees, they could be terrible, you know, it could be, they could be one of the siding services, but we need to just completely, you know, X out until there's some, some, you know, pretty significant changes that they make in how they run their business and how they compensate their notaries. So I think what I'm going to do with this little series of, you know, signing services that we talk about is, you know, if you guys are aware of any signing services, you know, that uh, you feel are also operating unethically and in, they're not operating in fairness and in how they treat their notaries and loan signing agents, you know, you guys can feel free to email me or comment below. But I think I'm going to dedicate specific videos to signing services just to make everyone aware of them. And I feel like, you know, if we all kind of work together in these types of forms, then we can possibly see some changes. So yes, cloud signing services, they are definitely not handling things properly with the way that they're running their business and compensating their notaries. And, you know, here we are, we're going to talk about it. So you guys, please share this video, drop down in my comments, like, subscribe. You know, if you have any questions, you know, drop down in my comments and let me know. And let me know what you guys think about this. Do you guys, again, are we still on the same page with, you know, calling out notaries and, or excuse me, calling out signing services and holding them accountable for the way they do business? You know, let me know what you guys think, okay? As always, thank you guys for being here. I appreciate you guys so much and you guys have a great rest of your day.
Bye-bye.